Greetings. Thanks for tuning into Channel Peace if you can find it. I would like to speak on uh, this video that a YT channel video that I've watched and it's this channel and it's well he delves into things that the status quo and how we're moving right along like bowel movement you know forgetting about things that concern us all of us the air water and food well he's dealing with flint michigan where we have just forgotten about it but people are still living there and he spoke on how there these citizens They're getting cancer, which we have just accepted like it's a cold. Instead of getting to the source of why are so many people getting cancer. Don't want to talk about the, the, the source, the root. Okay? And these are children now. Young people. Young people. Teens, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. If you get to be 70 and, and, and have escaped it, that's a miracle. You have dodged the bullet. Or you're just waiting for the other shoe to fall like me because it's like, dang. I don't know. Some people, uh, I don't know. But he's speaking of something that we have forgotten about. Because they have a system that moves us along, like in the bowels, how your the villi in the uh, intestines is like a wave and it moves you along. It moves you along. And that's how we being moved along. Even with uh, uh, independent journalism, I had esteemed them to be separate from corporate, but they moving right along too. And the thing is, people are getting paid to discuss others' atrocities while you're discussing in meetings with suits and ties and talking about, I don't know what, for months, they're still being annihilated, eliminated, liquidated. Done away with, terminated, finished off, put an end to, extinguished. While you're talking, and these channels are getting paid. That's what I want to say. People are profiting off of their pain, suffering, and sorrow. And, and they're forgetting about it. They're joking and laughing and going on to other things. Whereas in the beginning, when it happened, they know how to. This is psychological, what they're doing to us. We're being trained to move along in the intestines. The villi is pushing us through the intestines, through the bowel. That's what's happening. Even those who are wise and know what's happening. You have a few diehards out there that are just sticking with it. Oh, they're not going to move. But I see so many that were gone ho in the beginning. And had tears coming down their face about what's going on in the, you know, in reality with people's lives. The mental state, I don't know how they're doing. I mean, I don't know. But now they, it's, it's, it seems like I, I'm seeing them, they changing. With, they going with the flow. They have accepted it. Because with all this protesting and Saying you did it and you're guilty and we're coming after you, they don't care. It's getting worse. So that lets you know it can happen to us. It is happening to us, but it can happen. And this is precedent that it can happen to anybody and nobody is going to come from above or below. It's being proven right here in front of our face that anything can happen to anybody at any time and nobody is going to come and save you. Because I had thought that with those people, out of all the billions of Muslims and Arabs, they would get some help. And especially with Allah. But that didn't mean nothing for us. 
when they did that to George Floyd, Africa couldn't come to our defense. They still struggling with traitors over there, Sambos. In this day and age, still would rather drink champagne than for everybody to drink water. That's a quote from San, uh, Sankara, I think. I don't want to, one of those African uh, martyrs said that, wouldn't it be better for everybody to drink fresh water than for a few to drink champagne? I'm going to end with that. Thanks for tuning in and listening. But we're not talking about this. That's I'm going to end with that again. We're not speaking on real issues that concern us. I guess we're giving up, right? Accepted the slow poisoning, the, the slow... Uh, I don't know. I, I don't mind death. Death is fine because that's part of life. It's something we got to do. It's the dying. Because I made it known. I don't want to suffer. I don't want no pain. They got too much medicine to suffer with pain. So, mm -mm, that's dying. That's wrong. To be suffering, to be ministered kibbles and bits of it every day. That's torture. I'm going to end with that. But, uh, yeah, we have accepted it. And you're running back and forth to the doctors. They can't do nothing. They can't even say. They know where it's from. But all they can do is, 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 is administer you uh, uh, whatever the pharmaceutical company told them to to. to minister to you that's all they can do you can't have a conversation with them that it's the air water and food they can't speak against it they cannot they cannot cowards gangsters thugs I'm a witness to that I know what I'm talking about. Don't go in there alone. And I'm going to end with that. Thanks for tuning in and listening to Channel Peace if you can find it. And let's see if the clicker works. Okay. Okay. <sighs> <sighs>